This is Heather Levere, and today I'm going to show you how to review contacts in Outlook 2016. First, if you come into Outlook, you open it here by just clicking on the icon. You open up Outlook. We have the contacts. They can be over here on the left. That's this one here. Or if you're not using the compact view, it would look something like this. So let me just turn this off real quick. People. People are our contacts. So if you click on people, you have your contacts list here. I can easily search my contacts. So if I type in Jeff, it will bring up all my Jeffs. Looks like I only have the one. I can scroll through the letters quickly by clicking on the letters here on the side. You can see the different names and everything's sorted. And I can choose if I want to have a meeting with them. So if I want a meeting, you can quickly just select a meeting and go right into putting this on my calendar and exit out of that. If I need to add a new contact, I go up here on the left hand corner, hit add new contact. Full name will just be test test company and I'll add another email address and it will automatically display things for me and I just hit save and close. It's going to let me know if I have a duplicate and say, yep, yeah, let's actually update that for Ty. All right, we're good to go. He's now test test as you see that there. I have the ability to move a contact around to any folders if I wanted to. I have uh, the views that I can change up here and make it look something more like this or something like this with a little bit more details. Sort by the phone number so that we can see all of them. And lastly, in the list views. So this is how I can go through. I can choose to create a contact group if I wanted to. And again, we'll do test one, two, three. And we can save and close. This is now going to add in a group and I can add more people to my test one, two, three group. Just scroll over here. There we go. And add members from my Outlook contacts. Members, so Alan, Allie, hit OK. Save and close. And now test one, two, three. Anytime I need to email Alan or Allie, I can just type in test one, two, three. So if I go to email, it will go directly to testing group and it will automatically send them an email and that's sent out to them. If I need to do anything else, I can actually go through and assign task. I can do that by the individual, not by the group though. So I can assign a task. I can choose to reply with an instant message from Skype for Business or I can actually call this person if I need to as well. This is Heather Levere and that's a review of contacts on Outlook 2016.